A 16 year old girl died this morning at her school bus stop. Police say that a car hit her, then just drove off. That happened just before 7 o'clock on South Gladstone Avenue in Bartholomew County. Police caught the driver thanks to a witness. IT teammate Jasmine Miner joins us with that. Yeah, guys, this is uh, where it happened right over here. So really, really tough day for this community. I'm told the victim, Lily Strevel, loved going to school and she lost her life trying to do just that. And what makes this even more heartbreaking is that many of her friends and classmates had to watch this all go down. A life taken too soon. School bus trying to do their job, take, their, take our kids to school safely and return them home. But 16-year-old Lily Strevel never made it to school safely. Bartholomew County Chief Deputy Chris Lane says she was crossing the street to get on her 7 a.m. bus this morning, a bus that was stopped with its stop sign out. You need to be raise your level of, uh, uh, of consciousness on what's going on and, and be prepared when those you know, the buses, the yellow lights start flashing. That indicates that they're getting ready to make a stop. Well, he says the bus followed all the right steps. As Lily crossed the street, he says suspect Shyam Sunder Shankara Sambramanian hit her with his car, then drove off. All the while, her friends and other classmates watching the scene unfold. As we try to dress through Nathan and just get through this tough day. Bartholomew Consolidated School Superintendent Jim Roberts says counseling and even the option to go home was offered for those students. We know that today is tough, but sometimes the next day is tougher. Police say a witness followed the suspect and was able to lead police to him. Shankara Sambramanian is now in custody, but the community is still grieving over a young life described as joyful and loving. Her favorite class seemed to be auto tech, and she had such an interest and passion in that auto tech class that she was looking to pursue that as, as potentially a career after graduation. The superintendent says she even had a moped she was working on. As the loss leaves parents around the community asking one question. When you have a child that, that, that's a victim, then you, know, you immediately go to thinking, uh, what if that was your child? It does hit home. It hit, it hit home that much more. Yeah, well, definitely a very tough day for the community. Lily was taken to the hospital after being hit, but she passed away there. And the suspect is facing preliminary charges of leaving the scene of an accident causing death and reckless driving passing a stopped bus. Well, police tell me they are looking at camera footage that was on the bus, and it's possible more charges could be coming. Jasmine Miner for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook. Jasmine, thank you. And a 13-year-old girl was also struck and hit in a hit and run as she went to her bus stop on Friday. She has now died. IMVD confirmed that the news this morning. The crash happened Friday around 6.45 in the morning on Midhoffer, just north of 25th Street. Police have narrowed down the car that they're looking for from parts left at the scene. They believe it's a 2016 to 2018 red Honda Civic. Anyone with any information is asked to call IMPD at the number that you see here on your screen.